Tomas, uh, welcome to Bamberg, to Freak City. How are you feeling? How have your last days or your last, last day been? I mean, I'm super excited because uh, this is a club with such a huge tradition. I remember the old days when I was watching Bamberg playing in Euroleague. Obviously, the crowd was amazing. So it's an honor to put a jersey and I hope we're going to start winning and, and bring a lot of energy and joy uh, to everybody who follow us. Sounds exciting. Um, the first question or the thing that we always want to know is what do we have to know about you and who are you? Yeah, I think I'm a friendly guy, you know, good guy for the locker room. I always try, try and bring energy to the court on the both sides of the floor. You know, I like to play hard defense, compete uh, in my offensive contribution. I, I think I work a lot on my, on my shot past couple of years. So I developed a consistent shot and for sure I'm, I'm a type of player that aggressively drives to the basket and, and create uh, the scoring possibility for my teammates. Off the court I have family, I like to, to watch some documentaries, read books, enjoying good food and basically that's it. On your Instagram account we read family over everything. Yeah. How important is family? Yeah, for me, I mean, every time you have a bad game or your team lose and then you come back and your you know one year old dollar will come you you forget you know or you you watch it from different perspectives so for me my girlfriend and and my little daughter is is everything and i wouldn't i wouldn't exchange it for nothing else um let's get to the sports side of things um you've had some stations in europe already um, what kind of comes up is that you've been to Italy for, mm -hmm. for many years. Mm -hmm. um, would you say that winning the, the championship there was maybe your biggest success? Yeah, although I didn't play much this season, but uh, to be part of a winning organization, it's, it's always a great. You learn a lot of lessons and basically our season finished like at the end of the June. So it was long, it was hard. But definitely is worth it, and mm, we had a possibility to celebrate it in Venice, which is one of the most beautiful, you know, cities all over the world, uh, with the fans on the gondolas. So uh, definitely the experience I will never forget. Um, under one of your pictures, you wrote, "I've got some Italian blood running through my veins." Yeah, is it like that? Do you have? Yeah, that means uh, the father of my grandmother was an Italian. So, and I was able to, to learn uh, Italian language pretty quick, you know, so maybe there are some genes from our family. So it wasn't by accident that you've been to Italy so many times with so many teams? Maybe not, but uh, like I say, every time Italy for me represents uh, a beautiful country uh, with a great food, warm people, you know, and great fashion, mountains, sea, country that has everything and I was, I was really happy there. Now you're here in Germany, in Bamberg. Um, you got a chance to see the team play in yesterday's game already. Um, what impression did you have? Mm -hmm. I, re I really liked the effort and uh, the way the team show a uh, character. When they were down by 10, 15, never put their heads down. So it's, it's the a key ingredient in a, in a team when you want to create a winning culture. So you can build on that, you know, definitely. Right now, it isn't not best the moment, but like we, we all know in the sports, uh, things change really quickly. So uh, I like the effort. I like the way the guys compete and that's very important. Short term thinking, what are the goals that you have here? For me, it's uh, on putting the hard work and doing 100% on daily basis, you know, and trying to uh, catch the system of uh, our coach and like, getting to know teammates and uh, had that feeling like what this team needs. So to be able to, to give exactly, to be the pieces uh, in order to, to win games. We're looking forward to that. Thank you for your time. Thank you very much. I appreciate it.